like the girls' rooms are very, you know, pushed back. Yes. But then I've pulled those colours out. So, you know, it's, it's like I could imagine I could probably never, I could never write a book, but I imagine that's what it would be like. That yes. You've got all these elements. It's where you expand and you retract yes. on information. Mm, I like that. Mm. So you had the idea of the white white out inside and out well it actually started off i really wanted a black house right and it was always black. a black barn a black barn <laughs> yeah and um and it came again from this sort of exposure to japanese design and and we really wanted the black oh so burning, shugi so shugi yeah and um another friend of mine was got, wanting to use it in tikapo and so we together sort of tried to nut it out for here and the council, that was a, they came back with two things wrong with mm. the plans, and it was one was the colour of the house. We were allowed beige, white, or black. Uh, oh. Sorry, beige, grey, or white. Oh. And um, and they wanted a garden design. So I was like, okay. So I had to switch, and you know it has been because I go, okay, that's fine. I can switch, yes. and you know, and then your brain. Is, you know, it's that restraints again. So yeah. you go, okay, I'll put that restraint on and I'll work in with that. Mm-hmm. And then, um, you know, and then I'll see a house because my brain's now not thinking of red cars. I'm now thinking of blue cars. Yeah, you know yeah, I mean? yeah, yeah, yeah. And so you start seeing blue cars. And so you start seeing white architecture. Yes. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, I can do that. Yeah. And and had you already realized the idea of white inside at that point or not? Yeah, probably. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. No, definitely. Because, you know, I, you know, I do love the, my colour yes. against white. Yeah, because you with a an existing collection of yeah. furniture and objects, yeah. you know you need that. Yeah. To... But then, you know, then I went to my roofing company and went, right, show me your whites. And there was like, he was like, here's white and here's super white. White was cream and super white was grey. <laughs> you know, and I'm like, <laughs> oh, shit. Um <gasps> Because I was like, I just want white. Yeah. Um, so, you know, the battle of the whites started. Yeah. And as you can, you know, like whites. So what of, did you use on the exterior? So it's um, so it's an aluminium um, sheet cladding. Yes. Uh, tray cladding. Yeah. And it's um, so really good for this environment. And we had to go for the grey. But that, so what I did then was go, right, how do I make a grey roof seem like a white house? Yeah. And that was um, then going down the, the track of painting, like, the fins and, yes. you know, and, and the um, all the fascias and, you know, all those kind of bits that go around the cladding. Yeah. So, um, yeah, that was... So they are all in a white or white. Yeah, they're yeah. in a white or white. Yeah. Yeah. Um, and what have you used on those? So we've used, um, so Dulux, well, it's a, so Tui Tuft, so Dulux matched Tui Tuft. So Tui Tuft is a colour steel colour. Yeah. And Dulux matched, so we did Dulux all on the outside mm-hmm. and Rosane on the inside. You know, I like to not commit now. But um, it was, so, yeah, I wanted to kind of stagger the whites. Yeah. So inside it's resine warm white. Yes. So I want oh, to... Oh, so warm or warm? Warm. Warm. Yep, yep, yep. Warm. I always say I know, warm I suppose white. just so I have the name right. Wan? Maybe Someone Wan. Someone calls it Wan white. Wan white. I know. They're like, oh, Wan white. Um, but I wanted to stagger the white so that yes. it felt right. Yeah. And, you know, only I would care about that, but... Actually, oh, no, I mean, it's the hardest thing to get right, isn't it? Mm, white. Yeah, <laughs> get right with the white. Um, but it, yeah, it's, it's made it, it's made a difference, I think, because mm-hmm. it feels like there's a story. Yeah. Yeah, the white story. Because when you were looking, so yes, yeah, so outside you've got the colour steel and then painted in the Dulux. Well, colour steel is not, is not the roofing, but we've used the colour steel colour, colour yes. to be white, which then Dulux makes up in a paint. So oh, we, yeah. you know, like our, um, what cladding? What is the cladding material? It's an aluminium. Yeah, yeah. So um, architectural roofing do it. And yeah. It's same people who did, you know, like the bus stop mm-hmm. in town. Mm-hmm. So they they make the trays yes. and then they make all the um, fixings. You yeah. Know, whether it's guttering or whatever. Yeah. It's quite amazing, really. And then what is the? 
So all the block work. That's yeah, all the block off, work. That's all um, tui tough. Yes. And then, um, yeah. And then so the exterior palette came together through that steel, aluminium. Yeah. And the fins, what are they made out of? So they're all steel. Yeah. Uh, no, sorry, they're, they're aluminium. Yes. So those are all hollow. Yeah. And so little things like we needed a guttering to come off the side of the roof. Sure. So, so we put it, end one. Uh, it no, right? so we put it through one of the middle ones. Huh, cool. So you don't actually see it. So like in the plan, the gutter was supposed to go on the front side of the house. Yeah, and you're like, no, no. I'm like, no, no, that's like my favorite corner. So, you know, it's things like yes, that. So all of that's hidden. Yeah. Yeah. It's like, well, okay, guys, usually you would put it on the outside of the house, yeah. but can we think a little bit differently here yes. and actually put it... I love that that's happening more and more now. Mm. It makes so much difference to those when you're really wanting yeah. a sharp, crisp edge to something. Yeah, yeah. So, you know, I was probably really annoying, but actually I think Adam, our builder, really appreciated it because yes. he felt... Because he, he sort of has that mind as well, but usually it's just do what you're told. Yeah. Um, so or do it, what's the least... Half of Plus, yeah, exactly, and you know, and I think, well, I'd like to think that he quite enjoyed that process yeah. because he would quite often say, you know, do, do you think we could change this? Mm. Um, which was, I was like, yay, you know, he's he's been man, yeah, he's been yeah. a man, yeah. And then, so once you're inside, the walls are one white, one white, yeah, one white, one, and then what? And then under floor, yeah. Cork. Cork. Yeah. And so did you stain it, paint it? No. Does it come so, in like this? So they provide it in, they have um, either natural or black. Yeah. And I really love black floors. Yeah. So handy with white dogs. <laughs> I have to vacuum every day. But that's all right. Um, but I really loved, you know, it's kind of, you know, there's a lot of elements in here which... I, I love cork because it reminds me of growing up. You yeah, know, I don't know, and um, and I liked the, you know, the that it's pretty eco friendly and that it's, you know, it's got good qualities, yes. soundproofing, um, antibacterial, you know, like yeah. all these sort of things. So yeah, so they like this is. Um, what am I trying to say? They had like about six or four different grades. Or well, no, um, like the like. Oh, the finished finishes, yeah. yeah. So it's a, but um, I really love it. I like it how it's quite dull. Mm. You choose your poly that goes on it, so you can yeah. have it quite shiny. Yeah. And so court flooring throughout, except in the bedroom. Yeah, the girls wanted wooden floors. Yes. Fine. Um, <laughs> yeah, I wanted because it's obviously at the beach and there's lots of sand. Yeah. Um, you know, limited carpet, but yes. we did. You know, and so the carpet we did do then was custom yes um so i always had that idea in my mind that i wanted something quite customized for our space yeah you know when it's a kooky space because it's not a square room yeah i emphasize that and that's yeah. when you know we talked about maximizing corners yes mm. and so did you do the custom carpet with delana mm. delana yeah yeah so you did a design that yeah. really is very custom to that room. Yeah. Yeah. With so, an edging yeah. that traces around the shape of Yeah, mm. absolutely. So yeah, I I looked at a drawing that I did when I first approached them and it's literally the same. Yeah. yeah. So you've got in your main palette you've got black, white, yep. charcoal. No, no charcoal. Oh, well, that's, I consider that black. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> no charcoal. So black, white. Black, white. And then I've got this, um, the apple blossom. Yes. Which I don't really know if it's pink. You know, it's, like, it. <laughs> it's, it's It's not orange. No. It's not, it's not terracotta. Uh, maybe it's a pinky terracotta. I don't know. But anyway, black, white, terracotta. Um, we've got two pinks, a dark pink and a baby pink. Yeah. Um, the Japanese blue. Yes. And then we've got the, um, three greens. So yeah. r the really foresty green in mm -hmm. our bathroom. Then the mid green and then the light green. Yeah. Yeah. What's the mid green? The kitchen. Oh, yes. yes. And then so the it's, light green. Yes. It's that the sage. Oh, yeah. Sorry, yeah. I've forgotten. Oh, I was forgetting that that was a different. So kelp. Oh, yes. And then we've got this mid green. 
Oh yeah, so what are these 